you ever feel like some Unity classes are missing some really useful methods? Do you ever wish you could add these methods to Unity classes yourself? Well, the good news is you can, with something called extension methods. This is James Makes Games, and in this video, I'll show you what an extension method is, how to create one, and how they can help your Unity project. An extension method is a static method written by a developer that can be called as an instance method on an existing class, even one that wasn't created by the same developer. This means you can extend third-party classes like the ones in Unity rather than duplicating code or having to use static helper classes. To demonstrate this, let's create a new dynamic set text method for Text Mesh Pro that allows us to set the text value with any object. First, in a new C# -sharp file, create a class called Unity Extensions and make it static. Add using TM Pro at the top of the file since we're working with Text Mesh Pro, and add a public static void method called Set Text Dynamic. The first parameter is a class we want to extend. In our case, Text Mesh Pro UGUI. The clever part here is to proceed it with the keyword this. This means we can call Set Text Dynamic on any Text Mesh Pro UGUI object. You can also pass additional parameters to an extension method, so let's do that. Add a second parameter of type object called value. The second parameter will become the first parameter when we call the extension method. The third will become the second, and so on. Finally, let's add the method body. Just call text.setText value to string. We can do this because all classes derive from object in C, -sharp, including int and float, and all objects have a toString method. You can override the toString method in your own class to set your own format, just like we have in this ammunition class. Now, there is one downside to this approach. Because extension methods are static and don't technically belong to the class, they won't show up in the inspector. To get around this, we'll create a generic script called Dynamic Text Mesh Pro that will act as a middleman between the inspector and our extension method. In your script, add using TM Pro at the top of the file, since we're working with Text Mesh Pro again. Add a require component attribute to the class for the type of Text Mesh Pro UGUI. This means when we add this script to a game object, Unity will ensure it also has a Text Mesh Pro component. Add a private Text Mesh Pro UGUI field called text to the class, and in the class's awake method, set text to get component Text Mesh Pro UGUI. Add a public void method called set text dynamic that takes an object as a parameter, and in the body of this method, we'll just call the extension method we created earlier. Now we can add this script to any text object that needs to be updated dynamically from the inspector. Then we can just call the set text method on this script from our event with any object as a value. And that's it. Let me know in the comments if you can think of any useful extension methods for Unity. And as always, like the video and subscribe for more.